Hey guys, me. Hey, yeah. Lick, I just want to be telling y'all I'll be making two videos tomorrow. Um, a festival video. And wait, it's a festival, right? What we're going to? Oh, well, we're going to New Frontier, the amusement park. So we're going to be doing that first for the video. And the second. You'll be seeing an apprentice. Well, no, look. A pupil and a master. So, y'all be seeing that tomorrow. I might be making, like, if we have time, I'll make, like, one battle in during that apprentice battle. So, just telling y'all, y'all might want to see. Oh, and I'm making an Easter video. And we're doing some gimmicks on Chosy Achilles. Wait, actually, same time. Let's just do that Easter video. It takes two days. Let's go over the gimmicks of Chosy Achilles. So first, you already know you got Turbo Blades right here, right? And then you got these little things. While they're spinning, look. This is so interesting. I just learned this today. If this goes, look, if this little thing right here goes out while it's spinning, boom! It just absorbs, doesn't make it spin faster, just absorbs the hit so nothing happens. And then, you got the little teeth right here, look. Little teeth. The teeth, yeah. Can't forget about that. Let's just listen to that click real quick. Oh, yeah. Yes, that is awesome. And then, as you know, you also got the height extension. I'm guessing there's, like, two modes, because I don't... This always happens for me. Put it all the way high, you get defense mode. Put it all the way low, will equal you attack. And please don't not do this. Some people are like, yeah, you know what? Let's miss that spring. Yeah, oh my god, these triple blades come out forever. Please do not do this. If you mess with the little spring in here, that could mess up the turbo blade so it will not come out. It will not make it easily come out. It will make it not come out at all. It will make this little thing right here not come out as you can see like people are like how like people that don't watch beyblade and if y'all are turbo blade then y'all should already know that but for the people that just watch this video and don't actually watch turbo look before y'all know the turbo series you got this got the turbo blade here let me show you what this parable blade can do. If you're looking, I cannot burst it. Like, look, I am trying. That's because. Hold up. I couldn't do anything. I thought there was a flashlight or something. Um. Well, if you can't tell or you can't see, sorry about that. Hold, let me try to get. Yeah, there's no point. I can't get in the sunlight. Right between here, yep, let me move it. Look, let me show you. I have it in there. Oh, what's this? I cannot move it. Burst resistant wings, but that's right. And here's a little secret I know. Look, people say, hey, we should just, we just need to rip it as hard as possible. But no, rip it as hard as possible can equal to this. You know, just hit the stadium. Fly out, hit the wall, fly out, or I'll just roll and boom, fly out. So do not try to do this. My recommendation: do it a little hard, and then aim straight for the wall. Like I mean, it doesn't do any damage. I've done it for a long. I've been doing it for today, testing some tests. Does not hurt your Achilles. And, and you know, with the metal, you know, you just got this basic metal. That's all the gimmicks for Achilles. How about this? I have enough time. 
Valtriex gimmicks. Okay, let me show you. First, you know, you already got the first assistant wings here. His is a little different, though. You can take them out yourself. This one, you cannot put out yourself. You can, but I would not recommend it. You see these two? If you look over here, in the back, you can see there is no things for it to be burst resistant. So go for the ones that aren't. They will do you extra damage, everything. You already know you got teeth. Look, you already got the teeth. Oh, oh, wow, that's... That's weak. Oh, wow, they're both weak. So they're both weak, okay. Well, now we got Turbo Blades. Who so didn't know this, but if you check here, just in case of, let's say, um, Yajin, Tornado X, if he were to fall and hit right here, right here, on his little horse head, I guess you can call that, I don't know, I guess let's just say it's his helmet. If it hits his helmet, he immediately will knock off. You got that metal right here. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I learned this. People say that these kind of do nothing. And I'm just saying you, people say because they don't really know, but I think people say these little things right here do nothing. Just watch. Look. Let me show you. Only some of them will do, like, two out of three will do something. Mm, let me see. Let me find it. Yes, look. So if it's spinning and it goes up, Let's say, boom, he's hitting it. Look, he's. Say he's hitting it. Boom, he will. He will just stay off because this piece helps it. And. Well, we already know since it's a tag type, you got the flat. I guess I could do just one thing. Pretty sure people didn't know it's not Hasbro Bay. It's okay. There's one thing about my Hasbro Bay. Dusk. Dusk Rising. Take it apart. Get that little chip here. And look. Metal piece. I was messing around with my Bay Blades. I was like, yeah, I want to see what do all the chips look like. Dusk Rising is the most interesting to me. But I would recommend... If you go to Walmart, I would recommend getting the Mirage Fafnir. Oh, let me tell you about him. He's one of my favorites. Let's see. Let me get an example. Now, Trebea stands more out for the yellow, so... Trebea, yeah. Let's say these little metal pieces right here. Like, gray pieces right here. Shiny. Boom. Hits. Hits. Like, say... No, Luminor. Where's Luminor? Yeah. Say he was going in for the attack. And hits him. He takes hit. But it only works for Vice Ben Bay. So. So, um. That's all. I'm going to make making two videos tomorrow. And one Easter video. So, see you.